Greetings everyone. I've been meaning to uh, make this video for quite some time and I'm finally uh, getting around to it. Uh, I want to address the situation with uh, the black race as they relate to the Anunnaki. We the black race were seated in Lumeria by beings from Orion, Sirius, and the Pleiades. Enlil was a black humanoid. He was, of course, uh, a god, uh, a, a, a supreme being. He was the eldest son of Anu and Ki, who were Syrians. Inki was a black reptilian. Now, he may have been blackish green or blackish brown, but he was a black reptilian. He was the son of Namu, who was an Orion dragon queen. Now, around 100,000 to 40,000 years ago, Inki set up shop in Atlantis to begin creating Neanderthals and eventually Cro-Magnon, which Enlil was also Yahweh, did not like. Enlil would later destroy Atlantis, based, uh, which was the basis for the flood story, excuse me. Inki, also Satan, would eventually get back at Enlil by taking over the earth with his newly engineered Cro-Magnon race, which ultimately led to the fall of black civilizations and our eventual enslavement here in the Americas and around the world. So black people need to know that our fight is not just with the white man. I mean, he's only the outer manifestation of what we are fighting against. The real culprits that we are fighting are greys and reptilians. They're also your demons. And they're reptilians from Orion, to be exact. Draco reptilians operating in Orion. And they are aided by some beings from the Pleiades, Aldebaran, Procyon, Altair, and others. These are the quote-unquote Ankyites whom are reptilians. Remember, in the Anunnaki story, Anu, a Syrian, married Namu, an Orion dragon queen. And she had already had a son named Inki. Inki was not by Anu. Inki was a reptilian. Anu had and uh, Enlil by Ki, that was his, his real son. And the Syrian female was human. The Syrians, under the supervision of the, the Elohim, seeded black humans on earth. In Genesis 126, it says, and the Elohim said, let us make man in our image according to our likeness and let them rule over the fish of the sea and over the birds of the heavens and over the livestock and over all the earth and over all the creeping creatures that creep on the ground. Long story short, Inky hijacked this reality from us, created the Neanderthal, Cro-Magnon man to enslave and rule over the true angelic humans and rightful heirs of this earth. That would be black people. So it is the reptilians of Draco Orion along with other corrupt ETs, uh, as I mentioned above, that 
are still persecuting blacks and denying us our rightful place in the heavens, which is Sirius, Orion, and Pleiades, and other uh, systems, and here on Earth. This is nothing but a continuation of the Nephilim Wars, and I want you to Google Nephilim Wars to get an understanding what that was all about. It basically explains how we lost this world to reptilians.